want you to look at this book that I um, ran across. Kentucky Blues. Right? Uh, we covered some things here. I don't want to repeat out loud, but it basically here. You can, I'm trying to blow up as far as you can see it. I mean, as, as, broad, as, as much as I can so you can see it, everything. Uh, at least on these two pages here. And it has to do with Lincoln freeing their slaves and they're not happy. And they're worried about the uh, N-word Indians, which is right, it should be a double negative, right? Because the Indian and the, and the N-word are one and the same in the Oxford English Dictionary. Right? It says right down there, um, Right down. Oh, don't do that. Ah, can't blow it up anymore. But here, this page it really goes in on how um, the N-word Indians are different from that of the Apaches. How the N-word Indians will breed them out, will breed out the the Caucasians that are now on the land that lost all their slaves because of Lincoln. Now I thought it was huh? I thought isn't that interesting? Isn't that the same thing they did with ours and our women in that lesson on Philadelphia? Breed them out, breed her out, right? Take the women from your men, breed with them. Now that child is the father's possession. The man that just stole the woman, the, the Indian woman, the squaw, now that child is his possession. So now he gets a foothold on the land. Now you lose a piece of your inheritance. And now they're worrying that the N-word Indian will reverse that tactic on them. Look at that. And you see the part down there that caught my eye right here is uh, the N-words steady up there, steady farming up there. <laughs> okay, now, there it is. There it is, right? There you a mission. Our people were farmers. We ain't out here cutting people's heads off, acting like cannibals. At least the ones in Kentucky. So what is that land? Choctaw, Chickasaw, Cherokee. I, I'm not familiar with everybody. I just know those major names, right? And look right down there. Where it says, ain't 50 more. If you bring bring me the black sachet. Uh, nah, you, yeah, you, you can read it now. I'm just saying, like, this, this, this blew my mind. Because uh, I was, I'm just looking for that piece. I'm looking for that movie where that chick was like, uh, her and her dad. We're, we're going to the west in their wagon, and they stopped and seen this guy that was selling um, these statues. And they're like, oh, they're the uh, Asiatics of the far west, the, the male and the female statue. I'm just looking for that movie. And I stopped and came across to Kit Carson. Carson. He's the son of Carr. So I've seen that. I'm like, well... At least this page right here by their owning mission. They were Indians and they were out here farming. And they were worried about them reversing what they did in Philadelphia in 1777 or 76, where they desired the plan to take our mothers, our grandmothers, and our daughters, our sisters. See, they're always worried, it seems like, that all the evil things that they did is going to get turned and reversed right back on, on them. And that's why it's always like they want to get us before they figure we get them.